NASA's anticipated press conference today did announce the existence of new life. The biggest science-related story in the news today has to do with NASA scientists that uh, found microbes in a lake in California that uh, basically has arsenic in its DNA. Mm -hmm. So why is this relevant? It's relevant because previously scientists believed that all living things are composed of six elements, carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, oxygen, sulfur, and phosphorus, right? However, these microbes uh, are composed of arsenic. Instead of phosphorus. Instead of ph phosphorus. Dr. Felisa Wolf-Simon, a NASA astrobiology fellow at the United States Geological Survey, has broadened that list as evidenced by her research revealed today. Let's find out where this microbe is from. We're looking at a map of Mono Lake, California. It's in Northern California and east of the Sierras. The finding in a salty lake near Yosemite National Park in California shows just how little scientists know about the variety of life forms on Earth and may greatly expand where they should be looking for life on other planets. And if there's an organism on Earth doing something different, we've cracked open the door to what's possible for life elsewhere in the universe. NASA Astrobiology Fellow at the United States Geological Survey has broadened that list as evidenced by her research revealed today. Here's how. The key element of phosphorus is what links the backbone of DNA together. Arsenic sits just beneath phosphorus on the periodic table of elements and is toxic to life. However, Dr. Wolf Simon found an organism that actually learned to cope with arsenic. Taking mud bacteria samples from the bottom of Mono Lake in California, she gradually fed the life form arsenic. To her surprise, the experiment did not kill the organism. Instead, she suggests it incorporated the element into its phosphorus lifestyle. And to understand how life is formed and where life is going. This microbe substitutes arsenic for phosphorus in its basic biomolecules. And what else might we find? What else might we want to look for? It may be a game changer in the search for alien life. The finding in a salty lake near Yosemite National Park in California shows just how little scientists know about the variety of life forms on Earth and may greatly expand where they should be looking for life on other planets.